Hi, if you've recently dry lined your wall, particularly with a thermally insulated plasterboard, you may find that your socket screws are no longer long enough to reach the back box. I'm going to show you a neat trick today to get around that problem. Now, you can get longer screws from places like B&Q. Um, I've got a screw here which is 50 millimeters long, but depending on the thickness of your thermal insulation, and they can go up to 100 mil, um, you might find that these screws just aren't long enough. And certainly, that was the situation with me. So what do you do? Well, the answer comes in the form of socket switch screw extension studs. I bought these from Amazon, they come in packs of 30, and as the name suggests, they're extension studs. So you've got the, the screw thread here which fits into the back box of your socket. And then depending on the length that you've got to extend, you can just keep adding more and more studs. So look at that, what a clever idea. So you see for this electric socket here, I've put one stud into the back box. The great thing is you can just adjust the studs to the exact length that you need. And then you simply attach your normal length screws into the studs in the usual manner. Just see into this back box here, I've actually put two studs one on top of the other here, because the back box itself is a good 60 millimeters back from the front face of the wall. But again, I can just use the standard length screws that came with the electrical socket. So I really hope you found this video useful. Uh, information on the socket studs themselves, where you can find them, how much they cost, will be available in the description at the end of the video. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments section. And if you're new to my channel, I'd love to have you subscribe. You can do that by clicking on the link here.